Michael Harris is an authority on story selling. He's the author of Neuroscience Proves Stories Trump Facts. He's the developer of Storytelling Dice. And he's the creator of the most widely used business storytelling guide with 16,000 views. So let's try this. Tomorrow, tell the customer a story. One that packs so much insight that the customer realizes that they're not ankle deep in problems, but that they're really out in the middle of the lake, drowning in problems. It's then, not before, that they're ready to believe in the viability of your solution. But how do you challenge the customer's thinking without challenging the customer? especially when you have salesperson written on your business card. I mean, if you challenge them directly, couldn't that come across as an attack and end up in an argument that the salesperson is never going to win? Because the customer is both judge and jury. But if you tell them a story, it puts their ego to sleep. Because it's about someone else. It's non-threatening.